The nomination of Dr. Willie Mutunga, Nancy Baraza and Keriako Tobiko for the positions of Chief Justice, Deputy Chief Justice and Director of Public Prosecutions has been the subject of an intense debate. But an opinion poll by the Sinovit Group between the 17th and 19th May indicates that 79% of the respondents have no problem with the nomination of Dr. Mutunga for the Chief Justice's position. Meanwhile, 80% of those polled supported the nomination of Nancy Baraza to the position of Deputy Chief Justice, with only 14% not supporting her nomination. Development of reforms in the law. On the vetting process that was conducted in public by the Judicial Service Commission and yielded the nominations of Dr. Mutunga and Nancy Baraza, 83% supported it, while 10% had a problem with it. 7% of those polled did not know what to say. From Parliament, Speaker Kenneth Marende has called members of Parliament to a special Kamukunji session Thursday morning. The informal meeting is being held to try and iron out the differences in the Legal Affairs Committee, which have slowed down the process of vetting the nomination of the three nominees. The House Business Committee met on Tuesday evening, but failed to unlock the deadlock. One of the proposals was to form an ad hoc committee to vet the three nominees. In the meantime, Gishogu MP Martha Karua has urged Catholic bishops to reconsider their opposition of the nomination of Dr. Mutunga and Nancy Baraza over what they termed serious morality and family value concerns. And if it is indeed a question of morality, how many in government we know many things about, including abusing and misusing public funds? Why hasn't the church now led in the moral fight on that one? If cleared by parliament, Dr. Mutunga, Baraza and Tobiko will be formally appointed by the president to head the judiciary and the prosecutorial arm of the government in the new constitutional order. Francis Gashore, Citizen Live at 9.